All right, well, here I finally am at Colorado, and yes, I rolled in on this ginormous tractor, and no, <laughs> nobody noticed. Anyway, yeah, I thought, what better way to stand out like a sore thumb than to wear a white suit like I was heading into the land of the lounge lizards? Now, this is an elusive target, meaning that I need to remain stealthily, tactically testicle and not get spotted. I mean, the target today is a guy called Purdy Johnny Felty, and uh, apparently he's super paranoid, and if I spook him, well, he's gonna jump into his car and drive away. But that's fine, because I do think so stealthily that nobody ever spots me ever. Isn't that right, camera? Now, see all the way over there in that water tower? Yeah, Diana left a cheeky cheeky toy there for me to help me get the job done. So what I'm going to do is encourage this guy to go and pick up my brick. You, go. Come on in. I guess he doesn't want to do that, so he got Tweedledum to do it instead. So I'm going to try and bust a cat from over here. Did he see that? He didn't really, did he? You didn't see that, did you? Yeah. <laughs> You didn't, you stupid idiot. Now, uh, something that I haven't mentioned yet is that uh, Diana actually sent through a telegram after I arrived in Colorado and let me know that, uh, yes, I've got the elusive target, but it also happens that every single person on the map today uh, is also an elusive target. They were having some, like, buy one, get one <laughs> free deal at the ICA, and, uh, yeah, everyone has got to go, go, go. I bet all you sick and twisted buggers are really excited now, aren't you? So, yes, it's Kill Everybody Challenge in Colorado, but before we get round to that, uh, I'm going to approach this mission tactically, testically, like a real assassin, and do it quietly. I mean, I have no choice. The dude freaks out and he runs away if he hears any noise or if someone farts, so, you know, bye-bye camera. Yeah, that was me. You want to come and check it out? Now I'll take it a little bit further. I'll set off the old forklift alarm. Here he comes. Hi, I'm a hitman. All right, we've got another dude right here. Now, if I'm not mistaken, there's a pond here somewhere. <laughs> yeah, there we go. It's uh, obscenely deep. I don't know why, but it's deep enough to hide a body, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it's deep enough to hide a body. Anyway, I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of curious myself to see how many bodies I can fit into a puddle. What's that, like <laughs> five now? <laughs> oh, gosh. It's an underground tunnel to China. That's not racist. That's just like in Looney Tunes cartoons, there was always tunnels that went to China. Oh, hi. Uh, the cheeky toys I brought with me to help me get the job done. I've got my ICA-19 gold baller. I've got a remote CX demolition block MK2. I've got a remote Semtex demolition block MK3. And then in the water tower, I've got... I've got a sniper rifle to just shoot people from the thing. But um, I guess what I'm going to do first, I'm going to go, Hey, bro, what's up, elusive target? That was pretty easy. Thanks, IOI, for always putting in the work. <laughs> I love how nobody knows I did it either. <laughs> They're stumped. They're like, what just... Did he have Taco Bell for dinner again? So this is actually really... Oops. I was going to say it's really good because I can pick him off, but unfortunately... I just had my morning coffee and <laughs> I'm a little bit shaky. All right, I'm going, I'm going fusel. Here we go. Say hello to my little friend. I'm going to die, eh? I'm so going to die. I've got to get out of here. I've got to hide in a box somewhere. Oh, I'm out of bullets. Stop. Stop, bro. Morning coffee. Stop. All right, that was a bit, that was a bit intense. Fortunately, fortunately, everyone in Colorado is deaf. Like that guy. Oh, no, not more. Not, don't you dare. Don't, please don't come out here. I regret everything. Shut up, forklift. Bringing too many dudes I didn't expect you to bring up the map. So yeah, that was probably the uh, the easiest, worst planned uh, elusive target ever. But on the plus side, I've got about 20 bodies I can stuff into the puddle. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll bring them all over here and I'll make a little mountain and then... <laughs> and then I'll plop them in one after another. And ironically, like an absolute buffoon, I'm uh, still drinking my morning coffee, you know, because... <laughs> Because <laughs> my nerves aren't already high enough. When I get back to ICA HQ, though, and all of this is said and done, I think I definitely deserve an award for uh, dude most likely to keep his white suit white <laughs> during a, a massacre in a militia farm in Colorado. Beautiful weather out here today, though. Hey, look at that. Look at that Colorado sunset. Beautiful. Perfect weather to go for a swim, eh, boys? Alright, so now I'm pretty sure that that's everybody except old mate Perty Johnny Felty over here, who's uh, just taking a little bit of a dirt nap. Quite a graceful chap, this guy. Look at him. He's like a, like a swan ballerina. <laughs> Look at that hand flick. <laughs> All right, so this is what we started with. Literally, uh, as soon as the video kicked off, half of the map uh, bum-rushed me, and now <laughs> half of the map is getting pushed into a puddle. That's one, and that, that's two. <laughs> and this will be three, and four, and five. Now we're moving on to number six. There we go, number six. Uh, uh. <laughs> They're starting to poke out now. I think it's getting a bit too full. But I wonder, I wonder, will the game let me keep stuffing them in there, even though... <laughs> It's obviously running out of space. Well, there's only one way to find out. Let's keep stuffing these bodies in this five centimeter puddle and see what happens. 
Oh, goodness gracious. This, <laughs> this is so dumb. All right, I think we're coming up to like 20 now and <laughs> there's still room to keep putting more in. Don't you worry. We got enough room in here for, for the whole map even. Oh, that makes me kind of curious. What, <laughs> what would happen if I stuffed the whole map in here? There's no, no, there's no way I'm dragging the whole map to this puddle. Stuff that. Little did I know that the next seven or so hours of my life would be bound to doing exactly that. All right, Purdy, Johnny, Felty, the icing on the cake, the cherry on top, in you get, and bada bing, bada boom. Look at that. Look at that. So stealthy. They, they don't call me the master stealth assassin suit only guy for no reason. Look, you never notice that in a million years. Unless you head over here and then you just you stare it into it a little bit. <laughs> Gosh. Well, in that case, I think I'll head over to the water tower. I've got that cheeky cheeky toy that Diana left for me to help me get the job done. Although, admittedly, I've done a pretty good job of getting the job done on my own. I said job too many times then, didn't I? All good, though. Watch me stealth my way past these people. Undetected. Look at that. Like a ghost. Now, we gotta, we got to be very tactical. we got to be very quick. And we got to be very stealthy because... Well, I, I don't know why, but... I just shot three dudes in the middle of a footpath, and it's probably not the best idea I ever had today. Look at that guy trying to scope me out with his binoculars. What's gonna happen, chappy? Oh, we got some more dudes over here. All right, hold on. Did he spot me? I think he... Oh, these guys are good. Obviously trained professionals. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh, there's a lot, there's a lot of them. Uh-oh, all right, all right, that's fine. That's one down. That's two down. Three down. Four down. All right, switching to something a little a little bit noisier, uh, but that's fine. It's okay. It's all uh, it's part of the job, you know. All right, so that was a little bit hectic, but it seems like it's all calmed down now and uh, <laughs> completely unintentionally, they all died next to the puddle. But, you know, I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of a little bit anxious that this is going to somehow crash the game. I mean, it, it's pretty standard for Hitman to crash out when you do anything that the devs didn't think you would do, which is pretty much everything I've ever done in any video ever. But on this channel, we're all about doing the impossible, pushing boundaries and making your dreams become memes. There goes another one. <laughs> it looks like the reeds are having an epileptic fit. Honestly, I can't blame them. There are a lot of soggy men in that hole. There goes another one, I think. I, at this point, I don't even know if I'm pushing them in anymore. They're just kind of all falling all over the place. This most certainly is uncharted territory, boys. Nobody knows what's going on. Nobody knows what's going to happen. But by gosh, we're... We're going to stuff as many dudes in here as we possibly can. All right, and lucky last in your guess. All right, great. We've uh, we've done <laughs> we've done a splendid job at concealing this ginormous mass grave. <clears throat> now let's go and get that cheeky cheeky toy that Diana left for me to help me get the job done. All right, well this is bad. Uh, I've been spotted. That's okay though. That's okay. I've got two bullets. I'm going to handle it stealthily. Shut up. Don't make any noise. You buffoon. Mate, stop. Everybody is going to have to say hello to my little friend at some point or, or another. All right? Just say hello. He's a nice guy. Oh, poo. <laughs> they did it. They went and sirened the alarm. Hold on. It... Yo, what's the flip, bro? All right, well, this could go very badly. This this could go very badly indeed. I'm a little bit scared. A little... I'm not going to lie. I'm pooing a little bit. Got a bit of poo in my pants. Yo, you pretty mug. We'll find you eventually. No, you won't. Because you're dead. Ooh, I tell you what, it's a good thing that I shot about 50 dudes before this all happened, isn't it? Otherwise, I probably, probably... Oh, look, they're all searching now. I should probably run. Actually, good idea. Let me, let me invite them. Hey, pal. You want to come over here? I got a, got a puddle. <laughs> I got a puddle that I'd like to introduce you to. All right, here we go again. <laughs> here we go again. Oh, dear. A few moments later. Ugh, honestly, what, <laughs> what am I doing with my life? <laughs> Hold on a second, every time I pick one up, they all bounce. What in the world? I feel like it's the puddle's just getting prepared. It's like, all right, here comes another one, making space. So now, hopefully, I can finally climb this ladder and get the cheeky cheeky toy that Diana left for me to help me get the job done, of which I've pretty much already done. How many dudes are we still got dudes around this? All right, we still got dude there, couple of dudes over there in the barn, dudes over there on the roof. Dude over there cooking hamburgers. Oh, good thing they left me a uh, a snippety sniper rifle. Look at that. Look at this thing. Yep, yep, yep. This will be good. Will it though? I mean, if I want to encourage everybody to come to the puddle, I should probably just piss someone off and make them chase me. All right, then I'll, I'll put this back and uh, I'll, I'll piss someone off and make them chase me. All right, militia dude. Uh, I choose you and I also choose... Everyone. I choose everyone. Come on, let's go. Uh, Burger Chef. What the world, bro? 
What in the world, bro? Who's going to make the burgers now? Uh oh, they found me. They found me. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Retreat, retreat. Come on. Come on, 47. Let's go. Ball sack. Move to better vantage point now. Got no visual either. That's because I'm hiding. Ha 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 ha. I'm sneaky like that. All right, here we go again. Oh, it's, it's not even making a splashing sound anymore. Oh, hold on now. <laughs> now I can drag them back out again. Oh, no. That's how... That's... <laughs> it's so full that I can pull them back out. And then I can just stuff them back in. All right, then. Well, all that means as far as I'm concerned is that uh, I just need to drop them in from the other side. So you still got plenty of room over here. Definitely going to need a few more bodies, though. All right, you'll do... You'll do, uh, you guys will do, yep, yep, come on everybody, come on, what's going on lads, thanks for coming, thank you, thank you for your, oh, my gun doesn't seem to be doing much damage, what the flip, these guys are tough man, oh wow, they got that, they got that body armor that doesn't protect the head, alright, now let's see if we can create a little bit of a ruckus out here and uh, get all these dudes to follow me over to the puddle, you, you, all shot, oh, I killed him, <laughs> I guess I did shoot the ball, they're really, they're really coming aren't they? Flip. All right, that's fine. That's okay. All good. Just gotta go. Headshots. Come on, there we go. Come on. There we go. Oh wow, there, there's a flipping lot of them. Ball sack. All right, you know what? Um, I think we'll better handle this with one of these ones. Oh no, that didn't work. All right, that's fine. We, we all good. We all good. Okay, crisis averted. Nearly, nearly bad stuff happened. Well, I mean, terrible things happen to everyone. Except me. Do all of this for the puddle. All for the puddle. We gotta feed the almighty puddle. This is like a new religion now. We, <laughs> we gotta feed the almighty puddle. All right, now we'll try and get this guy. We'll um, try and attract the dudes in the garage. And it looks like it's worked again. All right, he's down and so is he. Oh, there's more coming. Awesome. One down, two down, three down, and there goes that alarm again. <laughs> oh, here comes another one. Epic. A little bit closer, mate. I don't want to have to drag you too far. Jeez, lad. Man, look at this thing. <laughs> Created a monster. And I'm not exaggerating. Uh, I think pretty much every single um, dude that's been shot has ended up in this puddle. Oh, no. <laughs> I can drag him back out here as well. Hold on. If I drag him out and put him back in, do I get points for putting him back in the second time? Nope. Oh, no. Just the once. All right. Well, maybe we'll just... Um, <laughs> this is so bad. So this lady right here is one of the targets, like, usually when you're playing. And, um, you know, apparently she likes um, cars. She likes cars. Huh? Well, that wasn't meant to happen. You, you were meant to, you know, come, come underneath the... Car. And then I was going to be like, YOLO, you, the new car. That's right, you went a new car. Not a secondhand car, but a new car. And the fact that that drew absolutely no attention leads me to believe that almost everybody's dead. Oh boy, that, that's a ginormous pile of bodies. Enormous. Absolutely ginormousness. A huge body pile. Let's put in another one. Plop. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't know why I'm doing this. Now, it seems like there are still a couple of dudes inside of the house over here. So I'll just take a couple of pot shots at the windows. Do a little bit of annoying damage and see if... Oh, okay. <laughs> I think I upset him. Man, I think our guy is somewhere around here. That would be correct. Yes, I am somewhere around here. What strikes me as super weird, though, is despite killing pretty much everyone except maybe uh, Michael Jackson inside of the house over there, I'm still compromised. By who? Hello, is everybody dead? Just want to make sure you're all dead. You should be dead because it's the kill everyone challenge. And then over at the militia house right here, it looks like everyone uh, immediately outside the house is dead. Oh, we do have a couple of dinguses. Oh, Michael Jackson, I'll deal with you later. Shut up. Now, before we go any further, something that I'd like to test out just for uh, the sake of science and stuff is uh, whether these hidden bodies are actually... <laughs> <laughs> are actually hidden if you were to drag a dude over here. Now, I will probably need to drag him around this way because uh, if I bring him this way, there are just a couple of, um, of guns on the floor that might cause a bit of a problem if they see him. It's just a couple, but you know. So I'm going to run around and see if I can find one person who's by themselves, which I'm pretty sure <laughs> I'm not going to be able to find anywhere. Oh, 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 oh. Old mate hitting the piss. Look at that. He's too busy getting drunk. He's totally oblivious to everything that's transpired. Come here. Oh, he's deaf too. All right, so far, so, <laughs> so far, so good. Oh no, he's gone. He's gone and found a freaking gun. Excuse me. 
Excuse me. Hello. Stop moving now. No, I won't stop. Just follow me. I'm trying to get you over here, you dingus. Who do you think keeps dropping these dollar coins all over the place? It's got a duck and wave. Duck and wave. Don't get shot. Over here, mate. Come on. Hero. All right. Well, he knows where I am. So now I'll use my, uh, my assassin skills to hide. I'll hide here. Got no visual. Of me. But what about this ginormous pile of bodies? All right. He noticed the dollar coin. He noticed that. But he, he's failed to notice the 300 bodies next to him. <laughs> Oh my goodness, this makes it all worthwhile. Anyway, time to head back up to the water tower, grab my sniper rifle, and just have a little bit of a look around and see if there's anyone I missed. I mean, after all, I am still apparently compromised. Oh yeah, 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 My Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. Where is he? There he is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll get it. I'll get it. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Oops, missed it. Wait, I'll, I'll get him next time. Hold on. I think, yep, yeah, got him. <laughs> Literally not another soul in sight anywhere. Oh, I'm not I'm not compromised. <laughs> well there you go. Michael Jackson was the last one. Well Mikey, I tell you what, it's been uh, it's been quite the mission today. It's been quite the mission. You obviously didn't see what took place, but I tell you what, it was wild. It was wild. I took so many bullets to the face. Somehow my suit's still intact. Not only is it intact, Mike, but it's absolutely spotless. Anyway, Mike, come on. Time to join the rest of the map. In you get. He's in there somewhere. You'll have to believe me. All right, so that's what uh, about seven hours of um, work will get you. <laughs> Hundreds of people stuffed in a tiny puddle. Unbelievably satisfying. I highly recommend you don't try this at home. It's totally not worth seven hours of your life, but you know, you do what you gotta do, and um, I did it. Now, where's this flipping PDA so I can get out of here? You know, I think the PDA was actually uh, in the dude's hands when I launched him uh, with the Semtex demolition block stuff, so that means it's, it's somewhere in the grass. I'm never gonna find it. Actually, never mind. A brief rudimentary steam search leads me to believe that the ledger is inside of Sean Rose's bedroom back over in the militia house, which uh, should be completely empty at this point. Now, if my memory serves me correctly, Sean's bedroom should be somewhere around. Oh, isn't that it? I think that's it. Click, 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 and ledger. Beautiful. See you later, Colorado. It's been real. Real freaking yee-haw! Bang, bang, bang. America.